Let's take a quick look, a quick review at the carpal bones on the right side of the body with an anterior view. In this view, space has been added between the bones so that we can better visualize the carpal bones. For context, proximal is up here, distal down here, lateral is here, and medial is over here. This is the distal end of the radius. This is the styloid process of the radius, the distal end of the ulna, and the styloid process of the ulna. The first, second, third, fourth, and fifth metacarpals are located here. We have two rows of carpals, proximal and distal, scaphoid, lunate, triquetrum, and pisiform are in the proximal row. Trapezium, trapezoid, capitate, hamate are in the distal row. Three prominent bony landmarks for the carpal bones are the tubercle of the trapezium here, the tubercle of the scaphoid here, and the hook of the hamate over here. So this has been a quick review of the carpal bones with their prominent bony landmarks on the right side of the body with an anterior view. Now that we've reviewed the carpal bones and their prominent bony landmarks, let's quiz ourselves. Pause the screen and see how many of the carpal bones you can name. And now pause the screen and see how many of the prominent bony landmarks you can name.